Hello everybody and welcome back to Team Magic Scrubs Matthew. I'm playing Dino Crisis Part 1. Um, we, well last episode you got to see me get completely destroyed by a Tyrannosaurus. We've picked up a lot of keys and we're just finding... Oh, I need an ID card. Um, a lot of different areas and it is getting a little bit large. So I don't know where I'm going at this point. Getting some sense of direction. There was something to do with the panels on a wall in a room with the T-Rex. But I'll be honest with you. I, I, I don't know the code. And I don't know if I've missed something. You're probably screaming at me. Watching. Uh, I have written down a couple of codes already. That we've been picking up in the memos. It's neither of them. Um, because... The codes I've picked up seem a little bit short. So I'm just going to keep an eye out on a lot of different memos. Oh, I hear something in. Let's go over wherever that is. Sneak out this way. In the lounge. Oh, I thought I heard something else there. She's looking at something. Oh, it's a sleeping raptor. You have to let raptors sleep. You're not dead. Oh, you're dead. You're dead. Give me some sexy bullets. Yeah, I'll take that because I've already died once. And I think that'll be useful. Now. This picture was jutting out a bit. No. Surprised that was nothing. Chemical manual. Okay. Oh, um. Oh, is this how to mix? Excellent. Intensifier multiplier. The four chemicals listed above feature our company's latest advancements. They're designed to perform exceptionally, particularly on front lines, where only equipment minimum. Yep. By mixing chemicals, the following two types supply um, recovery type. Quickly recover, yep. Yeah. An aesthetic applies the head of a bullet needle, yep. Yeah. Supplies that are produced by chemical mixing can be made even more effective by uh, with additional mixing. Okay then. Is that something? No. You need to stop whatever that is. Oh, didn't know they could do that. They can open doors. I thought I could push that. It's not dead. Blech. Blech. Now it's dead. You floating knob. Right. Is that because I left this one alive in here? Oh, wow, it is. Wow, cool. So T Rex smashes through that window. Still not got the code yet. Ooh. Don't know if I want to be out here. Oh, I don't like how that's tracking me a little bit there. Um, I'm going to check in here first, because that might be a whole other situation. <coughs> mm. um, strong magnetic storm may occur. Subsequently, communication department will close at 6pm. Stored to prepare, yep. Be sure to check the weapon storage locker in the lounge. You can unlock it with the combination 8159. I'm going to write that down. 8159. Yeah, yeah. 
Oh, okay. It's, it's telling me how to actually do the door thing, which would have been useful. The lounge. We were just in the lounge. Oh. So I need a key. Um, I could have swore we were just in the lounge. Let's go back. Right. A lot of backtracking. I'm sorry, guys. But I'm pretty sure we were just in there. Yeah, the lounge. Okay, so there's a safe somewhere that I missed. Is it behind this? It is not. Oh my Christ. Oh my Christ. Can I get behind the bar? Oh, it's this stupid thing, isn't it? Jesus. And the number, let's see, I wrote it down. 8159. Cool. Oh. You can remodel your handgun into a Glock 35 by using this. I get the handgun slides. to mix them. Or do I just automatically do it? Alright. So, yeah, I've already done that. Right, so... I'm running out of bullets, though. Which is a worry. Yeah, I've not been very sparing on my bullets. I might um, rein that in a bit. Although I am leaving quite a few bullets around. I think there's some up here. I still can't pick them up though. Do you know what? Where are they? Yeah, so these are darts for the shotgun. Oh, I can't just throw them away though. That's useful. So I just need to use them pretty much. In fact, you know what? I'll use them. get them out of the way for now because it seems it, right what this will do is put them to sleep but you only get three of them and it doesn't last for very long unless I'm supposed to put the Tyrannosaurus to sleep don't think that would do very much I'll be honest with you oh I'm expecting something nasty expecting T-Rex or something no that's going to happen at some point though yeah, because apparently I've got room for that. Doors locked from the other side. Okie dokie. Okay, so with a little bit of fumbling about, I've got, well, I've managed to find the code. So I think I know what I'm doing. Just a bit worried that he's gonna pop at any time though. All right, I'm gonna put this stupid thing in. Yep. 
And then I'm going to put this stupid thing in. Now, if I'm not mistaken, the code, which I've written down, yeah, is seven zero five zero three and seven. There we go. Excellent. The letter L is carved into the card. You got the key card L. Brilliant. And here's where the Tyrannosaurus is going to pop. Yep. Uh, right, I'm just going to try and stay back. Oh, you've got to be kidding. Because the grenade launcher didn't seem to do an awful lot. Oh, shit. And he seems to not be able to hit me when I'm further back. Yeah, so he can't reach me there. Shut up. Stay back. Oh my god, you can! Well, how was that? <laughs> Ah, I need to do that again, apparently. <coughs> well, at least I know the code, and I don't have. So do I just run out then? What, what do I do? Opens its jaws the first time it can't get me. And then this one it can, so I'm gonna fire now. Right, oh jeez, I just literally had to scare it away. But I got me arse kicked quite a bit there, so that was annoying. Yeah, you better run, you bastard. Jesus. Yeah, I don't hang about here too long. Right, okay, look. I'm going to switch up. I'm going to put on shotgun. Yeah, I've got them stupid darts on. It might look weird, but I'm going to use them up. Because I don't really want them. Yes. So, are these shotgun bullets? Oh. Looks like it actually. Um, yes. So now I can pick up these silly bullets, finally. And they seem of much more use than the little darts. Yes, please. Oh, you don't need to show me them every time. If I remember rightly, I could push this thing out here and that'll also give me some bullets, so I'm going to stock up if I can. Because these are the only bullets I seem to have found so far. Oh, it's just aid anyway. Right, okay. So see if there was any other areas around here. I'm not sure if there was.
Yeah, because I couldn't do anything with the elevators, but that's fine. I don't really want to do anything with the elevators. And I did the lazy beams. Okay, because when we, we killed that room, what is our ass asked us to do something, didn't he? And I think it was... Well, I think I've got to go out again. See if I can find where we're going, because I think it's something to do with that. Uh, the switches at the beginning. From what it was saying there. We'll have a look. Because this, unless I'm very much mistaken, takes you sort of around. Yeah, it takes you to the toilet for a start. <clears throat> takes you near the way you can get out oh god <laughs> yeah you're not bleeding Yes. Right, I might save up quickly. <clears throat> um the way is this the control room. If I speak to dipshit here if he lets us. goes to search for the dock. Nothing yet. I didn't find any sign of him on this level. That leaves the underground area then. It's the only place left. But there's no power down there, right? Not yet. That'll be your job, Regina. Restore the power to the underground area. Okay. Okay, so now I need to go back to the beginning bit. Um, I think I can get through this way. Let's have a little look. We we'll use our spider webs. Yes, that's right. So I can go this way. And, oh, can I? Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Whoo! Already forgetting. And I'm imagining where it is we need to go is actually near the start. For speed, I might push that. Because that'll get us back to where we need to quite quickly. I expected some kind of jump scare there. I'm not going to lie to you. Quite happy there wasn't one. That's okay with me. Oh, here we go, though. Now, the one over there has been done. There was a locked gate over here. With a spinny box. Oh. Aha. Uh -huh. Sweet. Uh, first aid, it's right. At least I know where they are. Just do a mad jump to grab this thing. <laughs> okay, Regina. Oh, oh. There's a door there. But... Is there anything on here? No. Nope. Oh, appears to be a note to survive using the batteries from 1F generator backup generator room here and vice versa. Okay. Understood. A battery is set in the battery charger. Will you remove the battery? Yeah. Okay. I can take that. I 
Okay. <lacht> hm. And then I put one in here, don't I? I cancel because I need to put this in first. And it looks like it goes uh, red, blue, green, white. Well, I pressed the wrong thing there. Oh dear. I'm not complaining. I am complaining. That's because I like to complain, and I'm good at it. So watch yourself. Right. Now, um, it should just be a simple case of putting that one here. So red, blue, green, white. Get your ass out of my way. Yes. Yeah. Padoobal, there it is. Fantastic. So, do I need to go back to the control room? Oh. Is that you, Regina? Yeah. So, do we have power yet? We're in the green, thanks to you. Look, I need you to come back here. There's something I have to talk to you about. <laughs> Right. So he's wanting me to go to the control room again, I think. Be nice if it actually named parts of the map, that would be pretty sweet. But alas we won't complain. We won't complain much more. Maybe. We will. Oh, that looks movable. Oh snap. Oh, is it another butt plug? It's not pulling them up this time. I used to do that. Wait, we'll let it go. Doors locked from the other side. That's unnerving. Right, now I need to remember how to get back to that control room. Um, I can't... I don't think it's terribly difficult. Unless they start throwing more Velociraptors at me. Run past here, run up here. Then there's that spooky bit with all the windows that's probably going to have some sort of massive jump scare with a T Rex up my bum hole. And, oh, there we go, Jesus Christ. What am I supposed to do here? It looks like I need to do something, and I'm not doing it. Blech. Whoa, 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 you had, you had health. Speaking of health, mind you, I don't know what mine is. Um, right, I'm just going to go the way I definitely Yeah, okay, cool. I'm just here. Check quickly is my... Ah, I still got five shots. Um, I can live with that. So, see what these jabronis want. Okay, and if I'm not mistaken, that is this one. <clears throat> What's the emergency? Gail just told me he saw someone on the underground monitor. Flash by pretty quick, but I'm sure I saw something. Rick, open the shutter to the underground area. What is it? It's a distress signal from one of our team members. It must be Cooper. 
Yeah, or it might be Tom. He infiltrated this facility, posing as one of the researchers. Can you pinpoint the signal? It's coming from outside of the building. To the east of the rear entrance we came in from. Look, we'll deal with it later. Our first priority is the survivor in the underground. It could be the dock. What are you talking about? He's asking for our help. We don't leave our own behind. Hmm. And what if it's a trap? Would you want one of us to come and rescue you? Don't bother. I'm willing to take that risk. Remember our mission. We're not here to babysit. That's your way of operating, not mine. All right. You have your access to the underground, Gale. So get moving. You handle your things your way, I'll handle my things my way. starting to get on my nerves. Regina, I'm heading out to investigate the underground. Okay. Uh, what will you to choose? Hmm. Gail's idea. Search for the clues to find Dr. Kirk. Rick's idea, rescue your comrade immediately. Hmm. Oh, I've, I've got to rescue my mate. I've got to rescue my main man. Right, so. It looks like I need to go back outside. Yeah, um... I think so. Anyway, either way, what I'll do, get out of here. Oh, God. I keep forgetting about that freaking elevator. Yeah, well, I mean, that'll be something that I can do next time as well. Um, so I want to thank... Oh. I want to thank everyone for watching. Do tune in next time uh, where you get to see more of the same. Hopefully this time we get quite a little bit further. I have managed to kill quite a few things lately, which is pretty sweet. Um, but until that merry time, of course, be seeing you.